Number one is staying in your stance, okay? I'm not going to get into the specifics of your stance except for one thing. Here's the thing I try to talk about about your stance, and everybody's got a different theory, but we definitely play with one hand up, okay? Definitely always contesting. A lot of people contest shots. Contesting shots is, is easy. Not many people contest passes. So we try to talk about always contesting a pass. So starting from the head up instead of from the base up, we do have a hand up. We always square our feet, okay? I don't play with one up or one back. If I want to shade a guy one way or another, you know, like sometimes you shade a guy, come on up here, you're the offensive player. If I want to shade you baseline, and I asked a lot of people, how are you going to shade them baseline? The stance turns like this. The only thing we do different in ours, we're still squared up right here, chest to chest. If I want to shade him that way because he's got a poor right hand and I want to make him go right, I just split him. I move it over one step. I, I, I guess maybe I was never very good at it or I never understood it. But this, to me, was too much of an advantage for the offense. There's too many good offensive players in our league that have great quickness. So by changing from solid chest to chest, shoulder to shoulder, if I want to force a guy one way or another, all I do is step over one and split him. If I want to force him to his right, I split him to his left. If I want to force him the other way, I split him this way, still staying chest to chest. Okay, so... We're squared up with our feet to the defender. Our knees are bent, but I had a player this year who was in the Morris Peterson mold, never checked a human being in his life. And when I told him to get in his stance, he got here, he was pretty good. I mean, you know, he did it like this, and I'm not saying it's right or wrong, it's just our philosophy. But <clears throat> when he was here and I said, get down lower, the first thing he did was bent over. You know, uh, how in the hell you can move like this, I don't know. But we talk about getting in your stance, getting down, sitting down like everybody else. All right? We also have some, some statements that we use on a daily basis. In fact, we put it on our championship ring, uh, the first Big Ten championship. Never relax. Try to never come out of your stance. As everybody knows, it's uncomfortable. But if you watch game film of any team in America, the number of people that come out of their stance is incredible. So once they're in their stance, we try to tell them to stay in their stance and never relax. That's the, use I, the word we use, never relax. Relax means get straight, all right? As I said, I'm not big on the technicality of everything. I'm bigger on the, the substance, what we get done. 